Alrighty, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. So today, once again, we have another skin video, inventory video. We've already done the black and white inventory. We've already done the blue inventory. Now we're moving on to number three, which is the red inventory. Now I've got a cheap budget, which is below 100 pounds. I've got a mid-range budget, which is under 300 pounds. And then we've got the expensive one, which is over a grand. So these loadouts don't include the gloves and knife in the total. However, I have got them. Don't worry. I have got combos for you with agents as well. So also just before we fully get into the video, I know I'm logging it out. I'm sorry. The weapons that I've chosen are the ones that I use in my own slots. Because in the loadout, you can change what guns you use. These are the ones that I use personally, which is why some aren't on here, like in the Gev, shotguns some of the scouts they're not there because i don't use them so these are the ones that i use i forgot to say at the beginning of the video so i'm adding this little segment in now all the prices of the skins are from d market and that is just because that is the one i use the most i find it easiest to use and that is just where i got all these prices from so just keep that in mind depending on the site you can go they might be cheaper or more expensive so just keep that in mind now kicking off the video with the cheap tier we have the pistols now, I'm not going to go CTT side. It's just straight up pistols, SMGs, rifles. No order. So first up, we have the Glock 18. We're going with the Candy Apple in Factory New, which is 75p. Then we've got the USPS Check Engine in Factory New as well for £1. And then we've got the Deagle Code Red and Field Tested. Now, this is expensive for the cheap tier, but it's the best red you're going to get. It is £13. Then for the Berettas, we have the Panther in factory new for two pounds then we've got the p250 nevermore in factory new as well for 80p and then we've got the tech 9 red quartz factory new for 20p now i know it doesn't look too red it looks more orange but it's fine it has red in the name it's not my fault and then to finish off with the cheap pistols we have the 57 urban hazard in factory new for 75p moving on to the smgs we have the mac 10 candy apple as well factory new for 20p then we've got the mp7 blood sport factory new for £2.30 and then we've got the mp9 ruby poison dart in minimal wear for 70p and then we have the ump full stop in factory new for 80p as well and then we have the p90 shallow grave minimal wear for £2 and then to finish off the smgs once again we have another candy apple we have the bison candy apple in factory new for 15 moving on to the rifles so we have the ak orbit mark one in minimal wear which is eight pounds then for the m4a4 we've got the evil damio in minimal wear which is one pound 70 and then for the m4a1s we've got the blood tiger in factory new which is four pound 50 and then for the famas we've got the survivor z in factory new as well for 40p and then we have the Org Radiation Hazard in Factory New, which is £1.65. Then we have the Galil Signal in Factory New for 80p. Now, the AWP is a bit expensive. It's the uh, AWP Red Line and Field Tested. It's £22, but it's, it's the best you're going to get for it to look good still. So and then to finish off the rifles, we have the SSG Dragonfire in Minimal Wear for 8 so this brings the total for the cheap budget up to 71 pounds and 70p so moving on to the mid tier we're starting with the pistols once again so we've got the glock water elemental in factory new for seven pounds 50 and then we have the usps traitor in minimal wear which is 12 pounds personally my favorite usps skin just then and then next up we have the deagle crimson web in minimal wear which is 25 pounds once again, Deagles are fucking expensive. I don't know why. And then for the Berettas, we've got the Hemoglobin in Factory New, which is £8. Which for uh, Berettas, I think is quite expensive. And then for the P250, we have the Muertos in Factory New as well for £5.50. And for the Tech 9, we have the Isaac in Factory New, which is £7.20. And again, for a fucking Tech 9, £7.20 is a lot. And then... To finish it up, we have the 57 Urban Hazard Factory New once again for 75p. Now there are a couple duplicate skins on this list that will carry over to the different budgets just because there isn't like a mid-range or say there isn't the expensive one. So you go for the mid-tier, put the expensive or 
put it cheap in the mid if there's no mid one, so on and so forth. So moving on to the SMGs, we have the Mac 10 Sakaku and field tested for 70p. Beautiful skin, may I add? And then once again, we have the MP7 Bloodsport, which is £2.30 in factory new. Then for the MP9, we have the Setin Sun in minimal wear, which is £6.10. So again, we have the UMP45 full stop, and we also have the Shadow Grave P90 as well, with the exact same ones from the cheap tier. And then for the Bison, we have the High Roller in factory new, which is £8. Right, to finish off the mid-range tier, we have the AK-47 Red Laminate in minimal wear for a lovely £40. And then we have the M4A4 Hellfire in minimal wear, which is £30. And then the M4A1S Cyrex in minimal wear, which is £15. And then the FAMAS Roll Cage in factory new, which is £11, which is quite a lot for a FAMAS. And then we have the Org Sid Mead factory new as well for five pounds again galil signal same one as the cheap tier so once again we have the orp red line however this time is a minimal wear for 40 pounds whereas the cheap was field tested so the only reason why i've done that is because there's only really two red orp skins and the red line is one of them so if i put a worse float in the cheaper tier then bump it up a little bit for the mid tier it makes more sense to me and then to finish off the rifles we have the ssg bloodshot and minimal wear which is also 40 pounds now that brings the total for the mid budget inventory to 267 pounds and 65 p so once again these aren't including the gloves knives and agents so just keep that in mind it will be a bit more expensive with those added on right to finish off the guns we have the expensive tier and they're starting off we have once again the Glock Water Elemental Factory New for 750, same as mid tier. Then we have the USPS Kill Confirmed in Minimal Wear for 50 pounds. And then we have the Deagle Sunset Storm in Factory New, which is 190 pounds. Again, Hemoglobin Berettas in Factory New. Then we have the P250 Crimson Kimono Factory New for 30 pounds, which is a lot once again for a fucking P250 skin. Again, we have the Tech 9 Isaac in Factory New for £7.20. However, this time we have the 5.7 Candy Apple in Minimal Wear, which is £50. So next, we have the SMGs. We have the Mac 10 Red Filigree in Minimal Wear for £60. Then once again, we have the Bloodsport MP7 for £2.30 in Factory New because there aren't any other red MP7 skins. And then for the MP9, we have the Hot Rod in Factory New, which is £65. Again, UMP45 full stop, ATP, Factory New. There isn't really any red UMP skins, so. And then for the P90, we have the Cold Blooded, which is £70. Now, I know this is like slightly pink, but this is the best you're going to get. And then once again, we have the Bison High Roller in Factory New for £8. Now, to finish off with the rifles, I think this is probably my favourite one. These, these are my favourites here. We've got AK-47 Blood sport factory new which is 80 pounds i had this low float beautiful skin then we have the m4a4 red dd pat in factory new for 62 pounds and then we have the m4a1s chantico's fire in factory new for 72 pounds now this is a beautiful skin in my opinion i love it once again famas roll cage in factory new which is 11 pounds and then we have the org hot rod in factory new you can swap this for the Sid Mead, if you really want to, because this is 290 fucking pounds. Yeah? 300 pounds for an org. I don't know if you really want to do that. That is where most of this money in the expensive list has gone. So if you want to change it, be my guest. Then again, Signal FN, ATP. Compare that to the 290 pounds for org. Then for the AWP, we have the AWP Wildfire in Factory New for 85 pounds. Lovely skin. And then to finish off the expensive inventory, we have the SSG Blood in the Water Factory New for £50. Now, I know there's not a whole lot of red on this, but it's the best you're going to get, really. Again, you could swap it for another skin. You could swap it for the Dragonfire, for the Bloodshot. Really up to you. You can mix and match to whatever floats your boat. But these are just like the most expensive versions of the skins you can get. Now, the expensive tier comes to £1,199.60. Right, moving on to the knife and glove combos. To start off with the cheap tier, we have the Navaha Crimson Web in minimal wear, which is around £160. And then we're going to be pairing that with the Resin the Red field tested gloves 
which is around 65 pounds now this comes together at 225 pounds now there are cheaper combos out there but for red ones it's probably the best you're gonna get right so now for the mid tier we have the huntsman slaughter and minimal wear which is around 240 pounds and then we're going to be pairing those with the blood pressure gloves in field tested which is 120 pounds now this brings this combo to 360 pounds now for the expensive combo we have the butterfly crimson web minimal wear which comes in around a thousand pounds it's a lot i know and then we're going to be pairing those with the scarlet shamag shamaga 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 the scarlet shamaga minimal wear for 380 pounds now this obviously brings this combo to 1380 pounds however the reason i have gone with the minimal wear scarlet gloves is because factory new they're like 1.5k so no bueno that's that's two and a half k for a combo we're not going that expensive all right we're, we're still keeping it humble you know what i'm saying and then you might be thinking oh why don't you pair it with the slingshot gloves now that is because of minimal wear those themselves are two grand so no we're keeping it with these ones because they're 380 they're still within 90 percent of people's budget if they're going for a glove and knife combo so we're keeping this one right so for the agents i have two for each side so for ct we've got michael cyphers which is two pounds and then we have d squadron officer nz sas which is 18 pounds now there aren't expensive agents but i mean these are 18 pounds so i'm gonna say that's quite expensive for a fucking agent but now for the t side we have res on the red shirt which is two pounds and then for the more expensive better looking agent we have sir bloody loudmouth daryl i know i think you all knew i was gonna say his name and he comes in at 20 pounds so that has been the inventory video once again as always if you want another color theme whatever you want to call it let me know in the comments if you want other type of videos just let me know what you want to see and i can try and do them if you are going to use this if you have any better skins that you think would fit better let me know as always like comment subscribe and i shall see you in the next one bye